Okay. <clears throat> Hi, everyone. Um, I just want to talk a little bit before we step into the arena for final boss about kind of the last 12 hours I've had uh, concerning Breath of Fire 2. I want to preface this by saying this is all my opinion about a 30-year-old RPG that I did not play as a kid, I didn't play as a teenager, I'm approaching it as an adult. So, all this should be taken with a pile of salt. Maybe I shouldn't even... No, I, no one may want to hear me bitch about this, but I have to talk about this. So I beat the penultimate boss, as we all saw. It took me a couple tries, I had a hard time, I had to bounce out of the dungeon because people died. Right. So I said, okay, am I ready for the final boss? And the short answer was I could have been, but it wasn't right now. You see, the best AP regaining item in my bag was Wisdom Seeds. Wisdom Seeds only restore 20 AP and they hit you for 20 health. As we learned in the battle against the penultimate boss, just because it uses all your AP, the Kaiser Dragon does not always do max damage. It seems to be based on how much, how many action points you have. So, okay, how do I get... There has to be something better than this. And there was. It's called, uh, it's called Wisdom Fruit. It does 100 AP, which is perfect. Reuse AP doesn't even go up to 100. But to get Wisdom Fruit requires requires cooking. Now, I don't think any of you... I don't think I've... If I've shown cooking, I haven't shown a lot of cooking. To get Wisdom Fruit, you need to cook to a Stamina Up item with Tuna. To get a Stamina Up item, you have to cook Fire Seeds, I think it is, with Tuna. And... For a moment, I thought you had you had to cook fire seeds by mixing wisdom seeds and roast, which would have been one of the worst times of my life because that means I'd have to go through the hunting mini game and hope I found a boar five times or hope I could shoot the boar five times. But thankfully, you could buy fire seeds now. I went to multiple FAQs, and I went to multiple YouTube videos about what the strategy for the final boss is, and almost unilaterally, the strategy is, well, you have, well, you have Ryu nuke him, and then you give Ryu more AP points so that next turn he can nuke him. Also, you should have a healer and a few of them were like oh you sh why aren't you using Ryu and Bosch for he uh, Rand and Bosch for both of their healing it's just like okay if I didn't have if I didn't pick the carpenter that let me cook items it seems like I'd be fucked I'd be double fucked if I didn't pick the villager that sold me fish I'd be like singularly fucked and I'm just like, this isn't the first time that I really liked a game up until, up until like the final stretch and particularly the final boss. And then the final boss really ruins it for me. Saga 2, Goddess of Destiny being one of those instances where I liked the whole game and then the final boss was like, okay, now you have to do it this way. If you don't do it this way, you're not winning, which was just everyone everyone grabs cure stabs and you just nail everyone with cure stabs until you outlast the boss. Attrition. This game, attrition. Uh, final bosses. Final Fantasy IV, same way. Uh, just the... The... the sheer level you had to be to just have a chance against Zeramis was so much higher than the level I was at. You know, before I got into the final dungeon, the all the guides I saw were like, yeah, you should be like 
mid 40s when you enter the final dungeon. I was in like the mid 30s. I took a risk coming in like at the low 40s. So again, probably no one whom I want to ask this question to is still watching this video. And that's fine. I recognize I'm, I'm alienating a lot of people by, by, and this is not the most frustrated I've been. I went to bed last night fucking frustrated because I spent, you know, I, I was laying awake like, you know, trying to, trying to, basically I, I say research, on my phone looking for where the fire, can I buy the fire seeds? Uh, okay, cool, where can I get the tuna? Okay, if I buy the fire seeds and guns, fly back, get tuna, and this is all without having access to the uh, majestic bird. So I guess the question I have to ask people who played Breath of Fire 2 and beaten Breath of Fire 2 and talking about how great Breath of Fire 2 is. Did you play this game the first time with a guide and knowing like the best villagers and how to get the best ending all that? Or did you play it wrong? Because I can't see myself playing this for the first time naturally like without being spoiled and like coming out like yeah that was really good because like there's so much to miss and there's so like there's such a grinding requirement at so many points i'm just like not even like miss it and make it much easier miss it and like like the sages uh you cannot grab you cannot grab the right carpenter you cannot grab the fish seller which the fish seller just means you got to play the fishing mini game which oh god I just, I don't know, I'm just, I, I think I'm also, I'm on like day, I'm on day five of streaming every day, so maybe that's also it, and I just, I want to be done with this, so I can go into Breath of Fire 3 and Breath of Fire 4, which I've had multiple people, multiple people tell me Breath of Fire 3 is their favorite one in the series, I've, told, I've had multiple people tell me Breath of Fire 4 is. I've had a couple people tell me that they really like this. I don't know if I've heard anyone say this is their favorite in the series. I, I don't know. Maybe might be a mistake to play all these games back to back. And maybe after I finish the Suikoden series and after I finish the Breath of Fire series, I need to reevaluate how I how I do these. But I need to. I think I need to sprinkle in some action RPGs in with all this, or maybe not. Maybe some strategy. I I don't know, but. I've got five wisdom fruits, which means I can hit the boss with my Kaiser Dragon form six times. I hope that's enough times. That's all I gotta say. I hope it's I hope it's enough. Because I'm not going back up to the surface. Anyway, thank you, thank you for letting me. Yeah, thank you for letting me say that. But like, thank you. Thank you for letting me have that kind of moment. I've been... That's been kind of fucking bubbling in my skull for the last, like, 14 hours now. Not 14, but... 12... 18? 18. Like I said, I'm, I probably alienated a lot of people just now, and I, I accept that. I, I don't know. Like I said, if you did play this game as a kid, and it's a... Yeah. I banish you to the. I don't know, we're in hell, so. Ha! Yeah, I'm. I'm not. I have no interest in finding out like what you do. All right. This is it. Oh, I got fucking nasty outside. All right. Ambiance. I don't think Breath of Fire One did this. God, God himself. You have done well to come this far, fated child. Or rather, Nicanor. And let me, let me... I should have prefaced with this, but like... I really enjoyed this game's story. I enjoyed this game's mechanics. I really enjoyed this game up until like the last couple hours of it. Like, is that normal? Does it make me weird? I, I don't know. 
Let me know. I must offer you my gratitude for opening the gate. Once I pass through, I will shower this world in my blessings in destruction. All will look upon their god and know only pure bliss as they pray for death. Crazy bastard! What the hell are you babbling about? Busting the world with destruction? What kind of crap is that? And who the hell is Nicanor? Uh, pardon the confusion. I was expecting you would understand. Nicanor is the name of the dead. It is your name. Oh! You're all dead. Sealed as you are inside that crystal, your existences are meaningless. Within, you shall suffer for eternity. Do not mourn for yourselves. Soon, you shall be joined with every other living thing in this world. Joined with them in death. Oh? This is the power of the fated child? Do you honestly believe you have the power to challenge me? To challenge God? Such imperatance. Hey, Lynn, a young woman who could only express herself through combat. She found a strength she had never seen before within the fated child and accompanied him on his journeys. And thus she was erased from this world. Lynn! Shit. Stop that. As it feel to be utterly helpless, I shall return your friends to the dust one by one and there's nothing you can do to stop me. This is the difference between your power and mine. Mina. Exiled from her own home by an ancient prophecy. She bore no ill will towards the people who cast her out. Thinking only for the good of her family, she accepted her banishment. Seeking only a place she could fade away. She came to this place alongside the fated child and her fondest hopes were granted. Thus she was erased. No, Nina! Fuck. Get up. Rand. He left behind the life he knew in search of adventure. His encounter with the fated child changed it forever. Together they journeyed across the world, overcoming trial and hardship, and thus he was erased from this world. God damn it! It must hurt, Ryu. Your pitiful lives, they break so easily in the hands of God. Hero? Fated child? Whatever others may call you, you are but an ant caught between the tidal wave. I will go forth and lay waste to all you hold dear. And you will be unable to do anything but watch, cursing your own weakness for all eternity. God damn it. Cry of Ryu's heart shattered Death Evan's seal. Do you dare resist my power yet again? Your impudence upsets me greatly, Ryu. Ryu snaps at the sight of Death Evan. Nice. Bow to my power, Ryu. Nope. He ain't bowing for shit. Nice. How? How could I lose to an insect such as you? Impossible. I cannot die. I am God! I've killed gods before. I've killed at least two. Not that fucking impressive, dude. Don't know what to tell you. I am God! Undying, almighty, everlasting! Ryo faded jo Oh, God. Oh, look at that. Hate that. Oh, what am I supposed to do? Is it infinity? Yeah, sure. You know, the power that I asked that I had to work kind of hard for. I don't like the fact that I got hit first. Um, I don't like how hard he hit me for either. Ryu's mind was flooded with thoughts of his friends. Uh, 
Bosch, Capetta, Ben, Aspera, do you thought of the dragon brood? And my sister, have you thought of the world? There were people who had fought alongside Ryu, people he had sworn to protect. Get up. You have to finish this. One way or another. Hello. Ryu knew that this time has finally come for him to fulfill his fate. Bruh, arrogant whelp. How disgraceful that you have managed to defy God's will for so long. Very well then. Red the flesh from your bones. Death is but the beginning. The pain I shall visit upon this world will be the subject of poetry and song. We'll kill and kill and kill and kill, 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 kill. Okay, what do we do here? I assume. I can't remember. I can remember if I have bluffs. Buffs. Not bluffs. Yes, to Valhalla with you. Okay, what's the turn order here? Ah! Too, too cautious. I might be being too cautious, but I'd rather be too cautious than dead. Just try and banish death, Evan. See how well that goes for me. Power of God. Ow. 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 Was that 156? This will be 999 again. Oh, 585. Ugh. Okay. a lot of MP at some point. Oh shit, he eats MP, doesn't he?
okay. Okay, what are we looking at in terms of damage we've already done so far? thousand nine hundred and fifty six right now. Okay. It's risky, but I'm going to try it. Arrogant child, be gone. All magic was negated. I, I don't know what that means. Does that mean buffs? Did you assume I was buffing myself this whole time? Oh, there's 999. Awesome. And 150. Okay, that was a risky gambit, but paid off. Negated her charge. Oh no, I hit. I hit him. No, I didn't. Check. Negated her charge. Interesting. Okay. Yeah. Get together, team. Go for it. Four seventy. Also, raise our defense. Become the power of God. Whatever, Junior. Suck Kaiser Dragon fumes, motherfucker. Is that why? No, yeah, that's probably why. Okay, that's fair. Seven plus nine 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 plus one fifty plus one sixty eight plus one ninety three. We're at okay. 
We're at 78.58, so we're very close. Together, team. We're good. We're doing this. 162. I don't know what to do with Rand. I guess. Close. You know what's going to do it? Yep. Or not. Shit. Wasn't expecting this. He has more health than I thought he had. Uh oh. Okay, there we go. Hey, it was Ryu. We beat Breath of Fire too. After I spent, honestly, I spent more, I spent longer bitching about me getting here than actually beating the final boss. I feel kind of bad about myself now. Oh, well. Here's, at the end of the day, the final boss wasn't that bad. I see it prep work. Would I have, I don't know if I would have been fine without the wisdom fruit. So there's that, but. Why? Why, Ryu? Why do you wish to destroy me? Fuck you, that's why. Why? Death, ruin, destruction. It is the fate of this world. Why don't you see that? Why is it that I must perish in its stead? I cannot understand. Why does this world deny its fate? What drives you to reject death? The power of friendship, motherfucker! I cannot understand. I shall fade from this world. Let me dream of destruction. Farewell, Nikandor. I'm a little confused. You're done good, kid. After those crystals closed up around us, I thought I heard your voice. Next thing I knew, we were all together again. I'm glad you had the chance to fight alongside you. Can't explain why, but it feels like my entire life has lived for this. We felt the dark god ourselves. I can still hardly believe it. And just think, without the help of everyone back home, we wouldn't have come close to handing this ba that bastard his ass. One by one, the faces of Ryu's fle friends flashed across his mind. For whatever reason, he realized he desired nothing greater in the world than to see them all again. He wished to share the triumph over the Dark God with all of them, and share his joy with one and all. All right! Oh, not gonna let us exit, huh? All right, let's get the fuck out of here. You know, my beloved sister, your wings helped us save the world you loved so much. Your strength has inspired me to rise against the curse of these black wings. Thank you forever, Mina. Cool. Is that it? That seems to be it.
All right. Well, like I said before, if any of you are still here from that little speech I had, I enjoyed this game more than Breath of Fire 1. And I think if I played it again, knowing, knowing the pitfalls going in, I knew the pitfalls going in. I'd be, oh, I'd be okay with playing. I'd be okay with playing this game again and trying everything again, seeing how I liked it a second time. Yeah. Hmm. Just everyone else hanging out, waiting for word. Sorry, guys. You did good, kid. I thought I'd find myself fighting side by side with a real live hero. There's no need there's no need to blush for you. Not after all you've done for us and for the world. We all think you've earned the title of hero. You see? You see? I told you you could do it. Come on, Ryu. Everybody will think something happened to you if we don't hurry. Ryu? was indeed troubling Ryu. You've done well, fated child. Your exemplary actions have granted the dragon brood their ancient wish. As with death have been defeated, the remaining demons have lost their power. You shall continue to watch the world, as always, but thanks to your efforts, the demons shall trouble the world no more. Again, congratulations are in order, young hero, Ryu. Prophecy has been fulfilled. The Dark God's grip upon the world has been shattered and peace will return once again. There's no reason for you to remain here in the darkness. Turn to the light of the world above. Return there with your friends. Farewell, Ryu. Okay. Not meet again, Ryu, but you have my eternal thanks. Your faith lies elsewhere. It remains to you to follow it. Okay. You did. Shattered. Not once the dragon said, Dragon Sage said that the death, death heaven had been destroyed completely and decisively. I cannot understand. I shall fade from this world. Let me dream of destruction. Farewell, you can, nor. So it's like a Lovecraftian beast. You can't kill it, you can only put it this way. Ryu saw another meaning in the sage's words. Death Heaven had been defeated, but not erased completely. His shadow remained, and one day the Lord of Darkness would return to consume the world. Ryu's fate had yet to be fulfilled. What? Pardon? Wait, we're missing a party member, and I think it's real. I wonder where he is, or what he's doing. I'm gonna go look for him. Oh no. The hell? Hey, somebody tell me what this is. It's... Why would you do such a thing, Ryu? You can't turn back, can't you? Come on, you can't leave us like this. That big sissy, don't you run away from us! That big blue monster won't hurt it won't hurt anybody ever again. Why do why do you have to make everybody cry, you big dummy? And so Ryu slept, guarding the gates of the netherworld just as his mother did. Ryu and his friends made a brave stand against the dark god, Death Heaven. And defeated him. That is not the end of the story. 
Deep inside, Ryu knew that even though he had sundered the form of death of him, his wicked spirit lingered. If left to fester beneath the earth, his evil would emerge once again to cover the world in pain and darkness. Ryu followed the dragon's heart that beat within him and chose to watch over the gate. He believed in his path. He was the fated child. Even in his deep slumber, Ryu heard his friends begging for him to return, but he knew that goodbyes were unnecessary. He knew that one day he would see them all again, perhaps far in the future, in the eyes of their descendants. Jesus. Ah. <sighs> That's, um, yeah. Hmm. A melancholy ending. Okay. I think we can leave it there, though. Hi, Mina. Um, yeah, this is fun. I know, I know, like I said, I know I did bitch a lot at the start of this episode, but... Oh, they, they just all had, had names. Okay. Uh, on to Breath of Fire 3 on the PS1. Patty Smith, <laughs> Big check. Uh, thank you all for coming. I appreciate it. I think I'll be coming back to this game to give it a second chance one day. That is that is almost certainly in the cards. With knowing what I have to do now and who to talk to and where to go, I'm going to give it a second chance. But uh, until then, uh, thank you all for seriously joining me on if you're join me on stream if you join me on youtube thank you so much it means a lot that people follow along with this stupid little hobby of mine and i made associate on, on twitch which is wild that that people would pay to watch me do this i just I have two subscribers on, on Twitch, which is wild. Emotes are coming. They're in the they're in the works. They're taking longer than I think I thought they'd take. Uh, join me there for if you want to watch these done live, please. There are only a, a, a finite number of RPGs in the world. I recognize that, and when they're done, I'm done. But until then, Ocean's big. Horizon's far away. Come join me on the RPG journey. And, uh, support your llama, llama. Support your local comic book shop. Your uh, your local video game store. Your local wrestling promotion. And support each other, please. Thank you, and all. Have a good day. A good night. Whatever whatever it is, wherever you are, have it. For me. Thank you.